Hitting as we head into the heart of the high school football playoffs tonight at Local 4's Casey Mincy joins us now in studio with a few tips to stay safe and obviously stay warm at these games. Casey. Spencer, you just heard David talk about the temperatures that are on tap for tonight and tomorrow, and it comes just in time for big high school football matchups like Grand Island versus Kearney and the Husker Faithful get ready to descend on Memorial Stadium for the homecoming game. The teams on the field have a game plan, so here's your game plan to stay warm in those stands. Here's the message from the coach. That's Adams County Emergency Manager Ron Pews. He says layers are a must. Make sure that the outermost layer is obviously water resistant. Coach Pews, or, or sorry, Ron Ron Pews says that weather like this early on in the season can catch people off guard. So you got to do your conditioning or find your winter attire now. And he says recent weather hasn't helped get people prepared. We're coming into a day that's relatively warm. It's been great last weekend. Now all of a sudden this weekend, it's a, it's a complete shift in temperatures. We have not been acclimated yet, really, to what's about to hit us this weekend. So we're really going from, from warmth to freezing says people need to remember their pets are also not fully ready for the chili blast so make sure to get them ready and as for those games out in the cold for the next couple days pews says to get up and stand as much as possible and when you're driving over the next couple of days remember those winter driving tips of giving yourself extra time and going a little bit slower on slick surfaces so that's your staying warm game plan you got it so hands in one two three break spencer back to you all right thank you so much casey well there's a good reason